Before we get started with the sneakers today, I would like to give a big shout out to my brother Pete and his store Please Sold on Instagram. If you are looking for a hype clothes, cool kicks, check his Instagram store out. The link will be in the description down below. Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? How y'all doing? How y'all been? This is your boy Benny coming right back at you with yet another video. Welcome to the show. If you're new to the channel, please consider like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification bell to fight the algorithm and help me spread the word and also these videos to more viewers. We are going to reach 100 subscribers soon, so please help me smash that like and smash that subscribe button. Today, we are going to look at another pair of Nike Dunk Low Retros as a part of the championship pack that came out recently, which include the championship red and the championship gray. These shoes is the third installation of that pack and one of the most iconic colorway at that. We're going to look at the championship golden rod. The suggested retail price of these sneakers in Thailand is 3600 TSB and that is about 110 US dollars which is really good comparing to you know most of the modern releases that have let's say 170s to 250 dollars price point these shoes became one of the most affordable and stylish choice in the market right now We can't deny it that the Nike Dunk is one of the most important sneakers in 2021. These shoes create so much waves and Nike released shit tons of colorway now is more affordable than ever. Now let's get started with the box and the championship golden rod Nike Dunk Low came in this red regular Nike box, nothing special there. The information on the box level said Nike Dunk Low Retro, black, golden rod, white. Now let's take a look at the sneaker itself. We have this black and yellow leather material on the upper. The black nylon tongue. A classic touch with the black and yellow Nike nylon tag. And this yellow brim on the side of the tongue. We got the black insole with the orange Nike logo printed on top. This is one of the key features of the championship pack as well since the championship red and the championship gray sharing the similar insole. The sneaker came with these polyester yellow laces and doesn't have any extra laces come with it. And wrapped it all up with the white midsole and yellow outsole. You guys are probably expecting me to say that the shoe quality is trash and the material quality is really really bad and for the most part that is true since the yellow part is really stiff just like any other releases this year but with a little inspection I found out that the black leather is actually really soft and plush when I press it down I can see the grain of the leather shows up and that is surprisingly good these might be one of the nicer dunks release that happening this year. If you are considering buying a pair of these, I would suggest to go for it right now since the price is really low and you will definitely get your money worth. Mm -hmm. 
And as for the comparison segment, we have this Goldenrod Nike Dunk Low comparing to the Iowa Nike Dunk High from 2020 and this year Nike Air Jordan 1 Pollen. So let's start off with the Goldenrod comparing to the Iowa. And as we can see, the yellow hue on the Iowa is much more vibrant than the Goldenrod Dunks. And apparently 2020 Dunks have a really, really good materials. The leather on the Iowa is really, really plush and really high quality, thick cuts of leather. Comparing to the 2021 Goldenrod, definitely on a downside since its feature is really thin cuts of leather and the material quality is not there yet. However, the color on the Goldenrod is a little bit more versatile comparing to the vibrant, really bright Iowa colorway, but that is really subjective. Maybe somebody like more vibrant yellow, but I would go with the Goldenrod for this one in terms of color. But the quality, the 2020 Iowa Dunks is the winner. Moving on to the Pollen Jordan one comparing to the Goldenrod. And as we can see, the Pollen just has a better quality material on it. The Goldenrod is on the inferior side in terms of quality of the material. However, the Goldenrod definitely is a winner in terms of affordability and accessibility comparing to both of the Iowa and the Pollen. Since the shoe just came out and really easy to find, plus it's really cheap in the secondary market, the Golden Rod will definitely be a good choice for anybody who wants to get a pair of beaters for their collection. On the other hand, if you want to get a quality sneakers to rock and collect, I will definitely suggest you to go get the Iowa or the Pollens. Since these two have much higher quality material, they will last a lot longer than the Golden Rod. Regarding the sizings and fit, this Nike Dunk Low Golden Rod will fit just like any other Dunks and any other Jordan one. So stick to your true size of those shoes and you'll be fine. Alright, and that is pretty much it for this video. If you like what you see here, please consider like and subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to hit the bell icon as well. We are so close to 100 subscribers right now, so please help me guys. And you are probably one of the 0.01% that stay until the end of the videos. I want to say thank you for your support and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.